Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to today's presentation on the crucial topic of the importance of mouth care for critically ill patients. In the world of healthcare, we often focus on the major aspects of treatment, but sometimes, the simplest interventions can have a profound impact on patient outcomes. Today, we'll explore the significance of mouth care and how it plays a vital role in the overall well-being of our critically ill patients. Before we delve into the importance of mouth care, let's first grasp the severity of critical illness. Patients in critical condition are often in a state of vulnerability due to their compromised immune systems and limited mobility. They frequently require life-supporting interventions, prolonged stays in the intensive care unit, ICU, and various medications that can lead to unintended consequences. The mouth is a gateway to the rest of the body, and its importance often goes underestimated. However, in critically ill patients, neglecting oral health can have severe consequences. The ICU environment and the use of ventilators can lead to a condition known as ventilator-associated pneumonia VAP. Inadequate mouth care can contribute significantly to the development of VAP, which increases mortality rates and prolongs hospital stays. Ventilator-associated pneumonia is a grave concern for our critically ill patients. Not only does it compromise their respiratory function, but it also places additional stress on their already compromised immune systems. By ensuring proper mouth care, we can significantly reduce the risk of VAP, leading to better patient outcomes and reducing the burden on healthcare resources. Maintaining good oral hygiene is not only about keeping teeth clean, it is also crucial for preventing infections and other complications. In critically ill patients, the oral cavity can become a breeding ground for harmful bacteria, which can then spread throughout the body, causing systemic infections. By implementing simple mouth care routines, such as gentle brushing and regular rinsing, we can minimize the risk of infection and inflammation. Beyond the physical benefits, providing adequate mouth care also promotes patient comfort and dignity. Being critically ill is an emotionally taxing experience, and the inability to perform basic oral hygiene can add to the patient's distress. By involving patients in their oral care routine and ensuring their mouths feel clean and fresh, we can positively impact their overall well-being. To truly recognize the importance of mouth care, we must integrate it into our ICU protocols. Healthcare providers should receive training on proper mouth care techniques and understand the importance of maintaining oral health in critically ill patients. Regular assessments of the patient's oral condition should become routine, and interventions should be prompt and evidence-based. An effective mouth care regimen requires a collaborative approach. Nurses, respiratory therapists, doctors, and other members of the healthcare team must work together to ensure that patients receive the best possible care. By communicating effectively and sharing responsibility, we can provide comprehensive mouth care that contributes to improved patient outcomes. In conclusion, the importance of mouth care for critically ill patients cannot be overstated. It is not merely a routine task but a crucial intervention that can prevent serious complications and enhance patient well-being. By prioritizing oral hygiene, we can reduce the incidence of ventilator-associated pneumonia, improve patient comfort, and uphold their dignity during their most vulnerable moments. Let us all commit to integrating mouth care into our standard protocols and work together to provide the highest level of care for our critically ill patients. Thank you for your attention.